Uh, the, the Einstein description says that inside a black hole, there's a singularity and locally, at least in that region of the universe, that constitutes the end of time. There's a singularity, maybe at the beginning of time, the other end of time, if you like, that we're also interested in. Might be the, you might call it the Big Bang singularity, the origin of the universe. And it seems to me to understand that singularity at the begin beginning of time, the Big Bang singularity, then we need to understand the singularities at the end of time. And the great benefit is we can see those. So we can watch them bump into each other. We can see them at the centers of galaxies. We can make observations of them and we can do calculations. Understanding black holes, I think, will be the key to a, a deeper theory of our universe. So in that sense, I think it is fair to say that black holes are the keys to understanding the universe. Chapter two, alien life and the Fermi paradox. Enrico Fermi is one of the great physicists, legendary Italian physicists, who laid many of the foundations of modern 20th century physics, so-called Fermi-Dirac statistics and all sorts of things.